Hello friends, today we are going to read what does Anu see? The author is Lavanya Karthik, the illustrator is Lavanya Karthik and the publisher is Pratham Books. So let's read what does Anu see? So who is Anu? Anu I think is this girl in this plane here in this picture and what does she see? Let's see. Anu loves to look at things, big things and small, houses on hills, ants on a wall. So Anu is a girl that loves to look at different things, big things and small things, whether they are big like this elephant or small like this bee or like this worm. And she likes to look at these things. Things in the kitchen, things on the shelf, things in the garden, things on herself. So here you can see all the different types of things that Anu standing here sees. There are things in the kitchen like these ladles, this pan, there are things on shelves. There is this cat here and this teddy bear. There are also things in the garden like this butterfly. And what does she see on herself? This worm that's on her finger. Anu sees patterns and shapes everywhere. Nothing at all can escape her stare. So everywhere Anu sees, she sees patterns and shapes. Patterns like this rainbow that has seven colors in stripes and it is shaped like a like an arch. Then there are these shapes of clouds. There are these swirls over here. These are all things that Anu sees. Spots on a ladybird, circles in trees, shapes made by people, shapes made by bees. So here are some more shapes and patterns that Anu is seeing like these spots on this ladybird and here you can see this tree trunk that has been cut and in there you can see the circle shapes in that tree and then here you have some man-made shapes buildings bridges all of that are also shapes and then lastly, you have these shapes of this beehive of a honeybee. They are six-sided patterns. They are called a hexagon, these six-sided shapes. Lines on a leaf, just like lines on her hand. The marks of her feet in wet seaside sand. So on leaves, you have these lines, right? She sees that too. And also the lines on her hand. You have lines, right? On your hand and on your fingers. She sees that too. And she also sees the footprints, the marks of her feet in wet sand on, in the beach. Waves in the water, waves in her hair mushrooms on tree trunks, birds in the air. So waves in the water also have this kind of wavy shape, right? And also her hair is also wavy in shape and there are also birds in the air. Words in a book that can take her to places full of new colors, new stories, new faces. So here is Anu reading this book about 
different places different people new faces and new stories and she is curious and she likes reading about all of these so she can see more shapes and she can see more new things things of the color that she loves best red the three wiggly hairs on her brother boo's head so she also sees these red colored things like apple umbrella and kite and her brother boo has these three hairs that are wiggly they are wavy and she sees that too sprinkles on the cake daddy baked today like the stars that twinkle at her from far away so she got a cake that her father baked and it had sprinkles on it and they were shiny they were twinkling like the stars at night rabbits in clouds floating up in the sky elephants in shadows come give it a try so here you can see these clouds that seem to have some shapes like this one looks like a tree this one looks like a rabbit and here you can see how you can make shapes with your hands and create shadows on the wall that look like things see this looks like a bird this looks like a rabbit anu is happy with the things that she sees do you also see what little anu sees so anu this curious girl is curious about everything and observing everything she is looking at different things of big and small size and she is looking at their shape at the pattern and she is happy with what she sees i hope you enjoyed this story thank you try these questions write down some different shapes you see around you with their english names try creating different shaped shadows with your hands it would be great if you can share pictures of these cut out different shapes on paper and create a collage of them or make other shapes with them